Hi everyone, my name is Vishnu Savaji, and I'm the product lead for collaboration in Google Workspace. I'm coming to you virtually today from New York City, and I'm excited to share with you how we see the future of collaboration evolving. We all know that communication tools like chat and video have exploded during COVID, and thank goodness for these tools. They've allowed us to get our work done. But what's become clear is that it's also exhausting us. The wall-to-wall -wall video conferences, the 24-7 pings from group chats, the accumulation of all these little points of friction all day long is simply exhausting. Overnight, we lost the ability to make face-to-face -face connections with our team, to work hand-in-hand -hand on a project in the same room with that real-time back-and-forth exchange of ideas. Our need to collaborate and operate effectively as a team has not changed, but remote and hybrid work has made that that much harder. In this new environment, virtual collaboration is no longer just a strategic priority, but a necessity. We announced Google Workspace last October, which includes everything you need to get anything done from mail, calendar, drive, doc sheets, and slides. It's all now in one place. As we think about how Workspace can build for this new environment, three key tenants have emerged. And these are not going to be shocking to anyone. And hopefully, these are things we can all relate to. The first is that work is no longer a, just a physical place. Work is where you are in that moment, where you're sending that email or you receive a ping. Time is more precious. The cost of an interruption is that much higher than before. There's now a blur between home and office, and COVID is stretching people in unprecedented ways. And finally, human connection is crucial. And we are thinking through ways in which we can bring this human connection back to all of these digital products, because we need that sense of belonging, even if we're not together in a physical space. Across the entire world, organizations have had to react quickly to the disruptions that were caused by COVID. And it's been inspiring for me and the team to see how all of our products, our cloud-native content collaboration tools, have been part of the solution to help people connect with each other in many, many ways. At Google, the transition to working from home came with its challenges. But we were fortunate that many of our workflows remained the same. As many of you know, Workspace was engineered for flexibility from the beginning. As a cloud-native solution, our products have always been accessible with just an internet connection. You've never needed to be tied to an office. We were the pioneers of real-time collaboration with Google Docs back in 2006. In 2008, we adopted a video-first conferencing culture to help remote teams work better together. And throughout the last decade, we've continued to build tools to help you collaborate and communicate better with each other. In our new hybrid work models, we need more flexibility than ever to connect as a team, whether it's creating a document together, preparing for that big presentation, or chatting with your teammates to give feedback. With different working schedules, it's critical, critical to always be on the same page with your team, your leaders, and with your customers. Docs, Sheets, and Slides are collaborative workspaces that allow you and your teams to work together in a single source of truth. We often hear from our customers about that delightful moment where they first see the presence of their teammates updating a document in real time. And we know that this may be a stark difference for some businesses that are working with legacy files where the work is stored on your computer. But once you adopt Workspace, it's hard to imagine life without it. I personally, I no longer need to wait for the next version of a deck to come through via an email in order to start working on it. I'm always viewing that latest document. When you're working on a project together or preparing for a big presentation, tracking your teammates down for input or getting alignment takes time. It's often hard to even get a sense of who's responsible for what. And so over the years, we built in capabilities that keep your projects moving forward. We added the ability to, have, to add comments, to have that back and forth dialogue with your team, to assign action items. We've also made the product more flexible. You can open up an email and respond to a comment directly from that email. And when you return to a document, we make it easy to see what's new, what you may have missed. And this is really the power of Workspace's real-time collaboration. And at Google I.O. this year, we announced our vision for taking this real-time collaboration even further with what we're calling Smart Canvas.
All right, let's get into more detail about what you just saw. The first thing is new interactive building blocks in the Google Docs product. Now, what is a building block? A building block is just a feature that we have in a product that helps you build something. You know, it helps you get to that full page document that you can then share with people. The previous building blocks that we've had in the product are text, tables, bullets, bookmarks, pages. And these are important, but they're antiquated constructs. And so what we've done is that we've, we've introduced new building blocks that are built for how we work today. The first key building block is what we're calling a smart chip. This is a way to connect text in your document right into real-time information. So for example, if you at mention someone in your document, you now have a smart chip for that person that can show you additional information like that person's location, job title, and contact information. You can use smart chips to refer to people, documents, dates, meetings, and many more. We're soon expanding this to support actions such as status dropdowns, voting widgets, and many more things like that. These help you keep your projects moving since folks don't need to constantly switch between different documents or different tabs. All that information, all of that riches is available directly within that document. We're also soon adding the ability to generate a checklist and assign tasks to specific people. We're doing this by integrating the Google Docs and the Google Tasks product. So someone writing a document can assign a task that then shows up in that person's task list. And what we're doing here is we're embracing the concepts that already exist in workspace. We're strengthening the concept that already exists as opposed to creating new ones that you then have to learn. Flexible formats uh, also fuel collaboration by removing unnecessary constraints on both web and mobile. And so you saw a visual of the new paperless format in Google Docs. What we're doing here is that you'll have the ability to remove the boundaries of a page to create a surface that expands to whatever device or screen size that you have. It makes it much easier to work with wide tables, large images, or it just makes it easier to give detailed feedback uh, in a comment. And if you want to print or convert to a PDF, it's always easy to switch back into a paginated view. In the coming months in Google Sheets, you'll be able to toggle between new views to better manage and interact with your data. Our first launch here will be a timeline view that makes tracking tasks easier and faster. This new flexible view allows you to organize your data by owner, category, campaign, or whatever attribute fits your data. It's a new dynamic interactive timeline that strengthens your ability to manage things like marketing campaigns, project milestones, schedules, and cross-team collaborations. We need to be able to bring the content to where the conversation is and vice versa. And so to do this, we're building tight integrations between our communication and collaboration tools. And so you can now seamlessly pull content into conversations and conversations into content. As a first step, we made it easier to present your content to meet directly from doc sheets and slides. And later this year, as part of connecting people and their work into one immersive experience, we'll be bringing meet directly into doc sheets and slides. This change will allow you to, do, to easily see and hear all the people you're working with while collaborating on the document. And because we know that a new idea often begins with a conversation or a gentle chat ping, we make it easier for teams to jump from a discussion and chat straight into building and reviewing content together. You can now create and edit documents, spreadsheets, and slides directly from within chat. And this reduces switching between this reduced switching between apps helps people stay focused as they bring their ideas to life. Search and intelligence helps you save time and do your best work. And this is integral to how we build workspace. Docs, for example, is already infused with powerful intelligence that helps people do their best work. We now surface more than 2 billion grammar suggestions just in the Docs product every month. To help people work smarter, we're introducing additional assisted writing features in Docs, such as warnings about offensive words or language. During these uncertain times, we've seen many disruptions to business as usual. Supply chain disruptions, shifts in consumer preferences, financial planning pressures, and many more things like this. And so more than ever, Data needs to be fresh and accessible from anywhere. Forms and sheets have been critical tools for our customers to go to, to gather insights and generate great outcomes, 
with instant and consistent access to the latest data. Since COVID hit, we've seen an unprecedented growth of forms as customers need to manage their crisis response. Behaviors changed overnight and the versatility of forms has been critical to instantly survey employees, to keep track of work order requests, to get organized with virtual events and many other such use cases. One of the more amazing use cases I saw was usage by healthcare customers. And so we've had multiple examples where healthcare customers have used forms to scale the COVID screening process for their hospitals. All frontline medical employees completed a daily self-screening entry form to assess their health, and they either received a green check to enter the hospital or a red X to return home, keeping everyone safe. Forms makes it easy for you to create your own questions and validate responses. And again, we built in intelligence into Google Forms. Forms can do things like predict the type of question you're asking and suggest the potential responses for you to choose from. As responses come in, Forms can automatically summarize the data. It builds charts and graphs for lightweight analysis. And if you want to dig in deeper, you can always open the data in Google Sheets. And coming soon to beta, we'll be making Forms even more versatile by introducing an API so that you can create and edit from using your own tools. On top of analyzing data from Forms, Sheets serves many different needs for our customers from project tracking to data analysis to financial planning. And like Docs and Slides, it's a living document that was built for collaboration. And so we've optimized sheets to help you easily collect, prepare, analyze, visualize your data, and surface the right insights. The smart components, uh, that, like smart chips in Google Docs, are making their way over to Google Sheets. We we're introducing people sheets into the product, and we're also building in rich search capabilities that enable easy contact search directly from within a cell in Google Sheets. Just like how we help you write with confidence in docs, we want to help you analyze your data with confidence in sheets. We've built in intelligence to help you save time and ensure that your analysis is error free. Here are some examples of what we're building into the Google Sheets product. We've recently launched formula suggestions and formula corrections, which help you build and troubleshoot formulas. SmartFill is an intelligent feature that makes it easier to automate data entry. SmartFill can easily detect patterns between columns, and it auto-completes data for you, even for complicated formulas like VLOOKUP. Smart Cleanup provides intelligent suggestions to make data cleanup faster and more accurate. When you import a file into Sheets, Sheets will automatically prompt you to review cleanup suggestions, such as removing white space, removing duplicates, applying formatting, and identifying outliers, so that you're ready to go straight into your data analysis. Finally, we're taking Sheets to the next level in terms of powering analysis at scale. With Sheets, you can now work with 10 million cells of data natively with Sheets. Or with connected Sheets, you can directly connect Sheets to petabytes of data in BigQuery, which is Google's serverless data warehouse. This provides finance and operations users in your organization with a familiar way to access data through a spreadsheet construct, but with a scale that's, that's incredible, uh, billions of rows without needing to know any SQL. So you can analyze data with familiar sheets tools like pivot tables, charts, and formulas, but you can do really big data analysis things like scheduling data access, refreshing visualizations automatically, or having an easy way to share data with stakeholders familiar with the Google Workspace. In the future, you'll be able to connect to additional data sources like Looker. Connected Sheets is extremely powerful and available to our enterprise and enterprise essentials additions. I like to think of Sheets as a Swiss Army knife of data analysis. You can do as something as simple as add a couple of numbers all the way up to something extremely complex like interacting with billions of data uh, billions of cells of data in Google Sheets. As Monica from Banco da Vivienda highlights, they were able to get more than 17,000 of your employees to move over to Google Sheets in under six months. And they did this by demonstrating the significant capabilities of Sheets relative to Microsoft Excel. In our fast-paced world, change is normal. But the pace of change that we've experienced over the last year is unprecedented. 
And so during these challenging times, it's critical for organizations to have that ability to be agile, to quickly adapt and respond to change. With Workspace, our tools enable to operate with agility and create new solutions and workflows to meet your business needs. One of the most critical workflows that we see in organization is that ability to know when something is done so that it's time for approval. And so what we're doing with the Workspace products is that we're building that key workflow of approvals natively into Google Drive, Docs, Sheets, and Slides. And this is launching to GA soon. With this new capability, you can now send a document to a manager, peer, or reviewer for approval. And once approved, your document is clearly marked as approved and locked. With disruptions over the past few months, we've also seen that it's critical to share information timely at scale to organizations that may be as large as a few hundred thousand people. Establishing a trusted source of truth is critical to keep people informed. With Google Sites, we make it fast and easy for you to collaboratively build a website without requiring specialized design or programming skills. We have templates that help you get started quickly and seamless workflows that allow you to easily embed doc sheets, forms, and slides embedded directly into that site. For example, the Taiwanese government was able to quickly spin up a Google site and embed interactive charts from Sheets to keep their citizens informed about the latest public COVID-19 data. Internally at Google, we have an internal corona coronavirus site that has the latest information on office status, return to work policies, parent and caregiver support, well-being, and many more rich resources. Another way we help you operate with agility is by designing our products to interrupt with Microsoft Office. We've taken this one step further. We're bringing Google's real-time collaboration and intelligence right into Office files. Rather than take a Microsoft Word, Excel, or PowerPoint file and convert that to a Google Docs format, you can now directly open that native Office file directly in Docs Sheets and Slides. And once you're done using a product, you can save all of this data directly back into that original file. This makes it possible for your organization to work efficiently with doc sheets and slides while also collaborating with people who are working with legacy document formats. With Workspace, it's also easy to build customizations that power your business critical workflows. I'm excited to announce the Forms API, which allows you to build custom solutions and integrations on top of Forms. For example, a customer support team can trigger processes based on incoming Forms responses, or you can simplify project management by creating and assigning new tasks based on form submissions. The Forms API is now available via public beta. And of course, everything we do is built on a foundation of privacy and security. As hybrid work becomes the norm for many employees, security, data privacy, and trust continue to be the foundation that make all of this collaboration possible. We recently announced the beta launch of Google Workspace client-side encryption, which helps customers strengthen the confidentiality of the data while addressing a broad range of data sovereignty and compliance requirements. Workspace already uses the latest cryptographic standards to encrypt all data at rest and in transit between our facilities. We're taking this one step further by giving customers direct control of encryption keys and the identity service they choose to access those keys. With client-side encryption, customer data is indecipherable to Google. Users continue to take advantage of the native web-based collaboration. They can access content on their mobile devices, and they can share encrypted files externally. When combined with our other encryption capabilities, customers can add new levels of data protection for their workspace data. If you want to learn more about these new capabilities, um, there are a couple of sessions that dig more into more that dig into more detail. GWS two hundred four and GWS two hundred five are a couple of examples here. I want to close the section by reading out a quote from one of our customers. We built a digital hub on Google Workspace to transform the way we connect with employees and partners across multiple locations and organizations. It allowed us to spin up major research projects in days instead of months, including delivery of major COVID-19 vaccine studies. 
I want to close this session by bringing these capabilities back to our mission as a company. Our mission is to make information universally accessible and useful. And this mission hasn't changed over the past two decades. But our approach for how we do this has evolved as the environment has evolved. We're no longer just a company that helps you find answers. Today, Google helps you get stuff done, whether it's finding the right words with features like Smart Compose or having more effective, inclusive, engaging meetings. And so our vision is to build a more helpful Google for everyone, no matter who you are, where you live, or what you're hoping to accomplish. And when I say helpful, we mean giving you, your team, your, your company, the tools to increase your knowledge and success. It's a mission that I'm really, honestly, quite excited about. You can imagine a future where whenever you go to a meeting, you're automatically briefed in advance with everything you needed to know. You have all the tools to stay connected with the discussion. Every time you have a new teammate join the team, they have access to all of that information that they need to get their job done. Every time a new project has started or you get a new customer, everyone in that organization get, gets access to that information. This is the power and the potential of Google Workspace. Finally, I'll leave you with some additional sessions to attend to learn more about Workspace. I hope you enjoyed learning about how we are transforming collaboration. Thank you.